Hi, Uncle Awesome here again with a follow-up video to the strange dumpster find. It might not be very strange or uncommon, but I haven't paid much attention to servers, so to me this was something new and old and interesting. I haven't become an expert on this type of system, but I will tell you what I have learned. Where your motherboard would usually be, you have what is called a backplane. Mine is called PCI-13SD. The computers that you install here are called single board computers. This backplane supports two systems, so I assume it means you can have two single board computers, or SMBs, installed. There are two PICMG ports for each system, where you can connect the SMBs, probably to make it easier to fit whatever expansion cards you want. These backplanes can be active or passive. This is a passive backplane, so it has very few components, and the SMBs are controlling the expansion card buses. This came with two SPCs, the Rocky 538TXV. It supports Pentium MMX up to 233 MHz, or AMD K5 or K6 processor, or a Cyrix 686 processor. The CPU that was installed here was an AMD K6 II, 350 MHz and 100 MHz bus speed. But the SPC only supports 66 MHz bus speed, so it's running at 300 MHz. I read the manual and I found the highest multiplier is 3.5, so I don't really understand that. 66 times 3.5 is 231. At most they can take 256 megabytes of RAM. It also has USB support, but I have not been able to get USB to work. And I got well below 5 volts when I measured them. I thought that this machine would be able to switch between SPC somehow, but the backplane only provides power and expansion slots to the computers. And that's it. So you need two monitors, two keyboards and so on, or a KVM switch. What can you do with such a machine? You could have one as a server, the other as a gaming computer, or it could be nice for playing multiplayer games, or conveniently play two games at the same time. It might not be a strange or uncommon computer, it is just two computers, but everything is in one case, with one power supply and one power button, and it's rough look with all the scratches and signs of wear and tear, it looks like a rough machine that can take a beating, built for endurance, and it feels completely different to all the other computers that I have. I just quickly wanted to say a big thank you to all of my new subscribers, suddenly I have almost like twice the amount of subscribers, and it's all thanks to Victor Bart, because he gave me a big shout out, so a big thank you to him. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope to see you next time.